So we are back with query, the query. जैसे हम भी याद है हमने लड़की उसको लेके गई मतलब इंजर्ड को हम लोग तो ऑफिस में थे ऑफिस में भी खा रहे थे डिलन एंड वेदर गाइ वाज इन द ऑफिस टॉकिंग अबाउट व्हाट टू डू नेक्स्ट एंड हाउ टू इंप्रोवाइज Well, that's weird. Phones go dead sometimes out here. Right when you're about to call the cops, though. It's a coincidence. Did you try the hang-up thingy? What? Here. What are you doing? I don't know. It's what they do in movies when the phone goes dead. You tap on the little thingy. We're not in a movie. Okay. Well, you know, how do you know that? Maybe that's just what they want you to think, man. So this phone's a no-go. No one has signal. Is there anywhere else in the camp that has a landline? Well, not a landline. What? The radio hut has some old broadcast gear. Where where you do your announcements? Where I curate my sweet summer jams, yeah, and where I do the PA announcements. It has some old equipment there. I think we could probably break something up and get a message out. All right. Yeah. Let's let's head over there and see if we can contact somebody. Put that back, Dylan. I will put it back when we're good and safe and help is on the way. Uh, okay. Just careful with it. I'll be fine. Okay. Uh, it's it's probably the weather. What weather, Ryan? Maybe it was the bears. Bear. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay. So for the sake of argument, what if that bear that uh, cut our phone line and just cut out all the power? What if that bear is waiting for us out in the hallway? Fair point. Thank you. We should probably tell Caitlin that we're going to the radio hut. They're probably freaks. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Oh my god. Yeah. We should probably leave that with Caitlin. Do you think she really needs it, though? Uh, she needs it just as much as we do. If she's staying in the lodge, we're going out there. You literally just said there might be something dangerous in the lodge. When? Like twenty seconds ago. Okay, sure, but that's because I really wanted the gun. Just give her the gun, man. Oh, I'm keeping the gun. No. Fuck that! I'm keeping it, dude. If those hunter guys come back, she's basically a sitting duck in here. You're being really selfish right now. It's not a good look on you. No, I'm just being safe. I can't believe you're being such an asshole right now. Look, you don't tell me what to do, man. Okay, I'm sorry, but it's it's not gonna happen. What are we even? What are we even talking about? Just give her the gun. We don't need it. We already have a gun. Fuck. Dude, why don't you just give her your gun? I can't believe you're being such an asshole. I have right back at you, Buster. Seriously, is this worth fighting for? No, not with your argument. Oh, okay. So now you just want to win the fight. Not cool, man. Not cool. Fuck off. Am I interrupting something? Dylan doesn't. Sorry, Caitlin doesn't. Chin up, big guy. 
it, I wouldn't really know what to do with it, okay? I trust you. Oh, thank you so much, Dylan. You're so generous and handsome. Yeah, no problem. Don't mention it. We get attacked. I will leave this one. Just catch the thing up. time again, is it? Why do you come? Why do you come if you've not found my cards? There are truths in the cards. Truths that can only be revealed if you bring them to me. So it's goodbye again. <laughs> I'll leave you with this. Remember who your friends are. Remember who's looking out for you. But I got the strong part from the Vegas, but it did not count. It's 10.30 p.m. Hey, I couldn't find anything to eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. Oh shoot, I left my bag. I, I brought you this. That was... Fuck, I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. How are you feeling? I'm okay. I'll be okay. Thanks to you. No, no, I... I just helped a little. It was all Caitlin and Ryan. You're here with me. That helps. All right, they're off to find a radio or something. What's with the, um, the... Oh, uh, we found another in Mr. H's office, so just in case. Oh, what happened to the lights? Not sure. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Wait, are they going to the radio hut? <sighs> Phone's dead. They're gonna try to send out an SOS or something. We're holding down the fort. 
Did anybody else hear that? Shh. I thought you said Dylan and Ryan already left. Stay here. I'll check it out. We don't know what's out there. It could be dangerous. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna check it out. Now I'm playing this gun now. Okay. Um, ten minutes. Not twenty minutes in hand. I think it's just that girl who came back. She found her way back. Is that a beer? I think I saw a beer just standing. Just in a video playing No sign of them. When you find them, let them. And keep me posted, Bobby. My blood and they mean that copper of pieces and body is made. So this may not be like the best time per se, but like... What? Yeah, so like I was just, you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and started camp and well, like now that summer's over and, you know, is that like the last time we're going to see each other, you know? Uh, sorry, Nick, what, what are you saying? Don't worry about Caitlin, she's tough. I know. I'm sorry, Nick, I'm just distracted. Let's just get through the night, okay? Cool. 
maybe I was misreading the situation back there, but kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? So are you dumb? Hey. Sorry. I just mean, of course I wanted it to happen. I just didn't know if you did too. That seems like such a long time ago now. You did want it to happen though. Uh, um, I... You can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. I... <laughs> You're just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. <sighs> what is going on out there, Caitlin? We've died. We've died. It's okay, I got this. This place. Oh my god. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Quick. I think that whack-a-mole just brought out the inner power. So the radio has like an actual radio? I thought it was just like for your morning announcements. Oh yeah, yeah, it used to be more of a actual radio station actually. Um, uh, it, you know, I mean, it is it still technically, but nobody brings their radio to camp anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Just lost it. It's weird actually that there used to be kids with their radio and their Thing and you know nowadays everything we need is on the phone but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day at camp so that we're not distracted by technology um, technology it giveth and it taketh so is, is that something like that you want to go into camp radio no like, uh, DJ or music or something Oh, um, yeah, I mean, I like music, but I think I want to major in, um, quantum physics. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. Uh, you don't really seem like a science guy. Oh, yeah, I mean, you know, not, not here, um... The thing was looking at us from a wider distance. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at camp. I do that at home. And then here, I, um... You're a wise, wise, cracking smartass? <laughs> uh, that's a little harsh. Yeah, I know. Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé Dylan. Uh, and do, do you enjoy the blasé Dylan? <laughs> Not yet, like, you know, whatever, man, it's pretty cool. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dylan Dylan. I'm Ryan Ryan. Well, actually, I'm let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. 
Yeah, I like him. He's that makes a lot of sense. I think it will attack us when we go back. What is that? I think that's the radius distance. All good? Uh, give me a minute. All right. His hand is still in the blood. I think I will need a minute. All good? Mm, maybe two minutes, okay? I can finish this thing. This video. Oh, this place is kind of a dump, huh? Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay. 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 Let me get this set up. All right. Anything over here we can use? The power tools? No. Um, that's Mr. H wanted more storage, so it's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, portable radios and whatever, so I think the range is about a mile. How do you even know all this stuff? Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to get a handle on. Well, if you like, I could show you the ropes. Like a class? Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Sign me up, teach. Anyways, this thing's going to need a bit of a power up, um, but that's where this comes in. That's my it's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but it's worth giving a shot. So we can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two-way radio. So, um, you know, we can talk, uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back, which is unlikely, but... 
Well, it, I mean, it is what it is, I guess. Yeah. So, what should I say? Uh, just, like, make it sound urgent. Okay. Hello, how's it going out there? This is, uh, uh, we need help. This is, uh, we are counselors at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, and there's been a horrible accident, attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears, and they are everywhere, and there's these hunters too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good, and a few of our friends are hurt, and um, we are in desperate need of help, so please, I mean, there's vicious bears, and uh, we don't know what to do, so please uh, come help us, SOS, uh, this is uh, an emergency, S save our ship, come on down, please help us. Did I do good? Was that... Swarm of bears? Yeah. Herd of bears. Yeah, I've heard of bears, but... Oh my god. Alright, I, I guess I should just like switch this over to the receiver and see if we get anything yeah, back. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie stuff. Okay, yeah, sure. Did he, did he say lodge? I don't know. Two males in the radio shack near the cabins. Another couple unaccounted for. Okay. Um, Holy shit, they're talking about us. Radio! Fuck! They know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Hey, hey, Shit. Let's, let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's, let's go find Caitlin and everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? I have no idea. Uh, Ryan? Is it a bear? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick, they're coming up the path. Oh, shit. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Um, what about the PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can um, tell them to hide or something. Yeah. Uh, oh, fuck, no. Oh, shit. Uh, the, uh, hold the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get in get, get into the cabin now. Go! Go! Oh, fuck, dude. They're gone. Well, 
What the hell? We'll face the scene. We gotta kill it. It's not a normal animal, man. I don't think a gun's gonna cut it. Oh, shit. You got a better idea? The tools, take the power tools. Well, if it's got hearing like a like a dog, maybe. Uh, I mean, we could we could play a really high pitched feedback loop and crank it to the max. And uh, I mean, it would hurt like hell. But okay, fine. Let's do it. Feedback thing. All right. Hey, Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay, yeah, right. So, there's something missing. I do. What's missing? Hold the wire. Fix it. I'll cover you. Do it now. Go quickly. Get the wire, get the wire. What? Get the wire. The thing, get it. On it. Plug it, plug it into the thing. Uh, keep pressure on uh. What do I do? What do I do? The button, the button. Oh, we blew the speaker. Uh, it did the trick. Uh, nice work, Dylan. <laughs> Dylan lost his... wrist. Most valuable hand. Oh, fuck my hand. Right, right. Okay. Uh, just hold on. Why did you do that? You told me to. That was a bad idea. I don't know. That thing's gone, but we heard those hunter guys on the radio. What? Picked up their walkie signal. They knew we were here. Fuck, you get a message out? I'm not sure anyone heard it. <sighs> Great. What the hell was going on at... Oh my god! Tell them what happened! Oh, um... I'm okay. I, I, I mean... 
I'm not, um, but it's, it doesn't, doesn't hurt. Okay, you're in shock. Holy fucking shit. Uh. Did that thing do this? No. Well, sort of. It... Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. What the fuck? Did she shoot at us? Who's there? So the end of the year and the Should we follow her? Please, please, please. Only thing that can keep me going. Bye. 